When given a continuous function over a closed interval, you can find the average y value by finding the area under the curve and dividing that by the interval. Geometrically, the average value is the height of a rectangle constructed over the closed interval whose area is the same as the area under the graph of f over that same interval. In the example below, we're given the function x squared, which is a continuous function, and we want to find the average value and the x value that yields the average value. So this is continuous. For the first part, f av equals 1 over 2 minus 0, integral from 0 to 2 of x squared dx. So our average value is 1 half, 1 third x cubed from 0 to 2. So f av is 1 sixth multiplied by 8, which is 4 thirds. So the average y value over the interval from 0 to 2 is 4 thirds. So now for the second part, we want to find the x value that yields the average value. So when does f of x equal f av? That's when x squared equals 4 thirds. To solve for x, I'll square root both sides. And we have x is plus or minus 2 over square root 3. Now we want the x value that falls in this interval. So x is positive 2 square root 3 over 3 is an element of this interval 0, 2 that satisfies the average value when you plug it into your initial function.